Hi, Ravi. Hello, hello. It goes good. I just ate a peanut butter sandwich. I am living the life of luxury. Sheree. Hey, what the fuck? I just played ads. Why is it telling me there's more ads? What is going on? Why have I got more <laughs> uh? What? What is happening? Phobia says I have ads running right now. You know, I never noticed that. Hi, Luna. Yeah, it's it's literally the 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 Christmas ball is the the entire Christmas room okay, scene so like, distorted or whatever. OBS is full of OBS. I don't know if we have ads on it right now or not. I haven't the foggiest. Um, yeah. All right. Happy holidays! Hello! Hi! You don't have ads, but you've got a sub. <laughs> I don't I don't know. I don't know. You tired? You cleaned and organized. Oh that's good. Um, but hi friends. I hope you all had a nice Christmas. Um we're in this weird sort of like liminal stage between Christmas and the end of the year. You're all pretty much everyone's on the fucking tree at this point. 
<laughs> well, I appreciate you coming in here, Ari. Yeah, a bunch of tree huggers. Filthy tree huggers. That, yeah. Did I get, I think everyone's still on there. I can't remember when I last updated it. I'll check it again tomorrow. The tenons? I don't think I have fragged, but it it sounds familiar. Ow. Um, possibly? Um, the tenons. It's on your list? Oh wow, apparently I'm typing in caps. Is it like a house flipper type one? Become the best landlord. <gasps> Kitty! Mary Chrysler! Mary Chrysler. Mary Chrysler? The list. The list. It feels a lot like The Sims. It looks interesting, actually. I have added it to my wish list. Thanks, Frank. <laughs> so many lists. Well, these are the ones, you know, like you, you look out for on key mailer. Um, Kitty, if if you have a preference, don't forget you can pick a color. We only we're only two subs away from matching the blanket a number of squares for the blanket for the first half of the year. Except I'm very, very, very far behind. But Yes, if you have a color you would like to add to the blanket, now is your time. Ali, hi. I I feel like I'm wearing. I didn't think about it when I popped these in today, and I was like, oh wait, we might be trying to set fire to things. <laughs> fire. All right. Let me. 12, 28. Ah! Eddie. So yes, just, just one. Whoop, just a color. We are, what well, we are, yes, they will be burninating. It's my Christmas room, we have it every year. So everyone, um, everyone with a sub is on the tree. I know. Um, and then yeah, yeah, you were on there. I had to look. Um, yeah, you're there. But yeah, everyone with a sub is on the tree. <laughs> and and it's just the thing we do for Christmas. It's part of the Christmas room. But I keep forgetting about it. And also, there is our mod appreciation board because this wonderful group of people have helped keep me focused and organized and inspired and somewhat sane all year. Hi, Mega Jelly Mac. Hello, hello, hello. We love the mods, and all of them have got like things that they're really good at, like being sassy and being a smartass and being cheeky. Yeah, they've all got their special teeth. They're some good people. Yeah, being all of the above. The, the tree is more ornament croquembouch. I don't even know what that is. It's wonderful. I had to, I, I had to like shrink the Christmas decorations down to me. Um. What is? Oh, it's the game. I was like, what is that audio? <laughs> it's the Steam page for, um. For the tenants. I was like, this is sounding like some sort of like weird poetry recital. Um Yeah, 
the, yeah, there's there's no douchebags on there that I know of. I mean, there's a couple of sub people on there that I don't know, but I'm pretty sure none of them are douchebags. Um, but yes, Kitty, so if you would like to, you can give me a color and I will add that. Um, after you, there are two more squares and then the blanket is full for the air, which is bonkers. And uh, then pink and then next year. I mean, I, I'm not surprised by that at all, actually. Um, and then next year we're doing a scarf for the sub-project, which will be a lot easier. Um, so yeah, that's it. Just two more. Um, so plans are going forward. Okay. Um, so many Dell folks in the mosh pit. Isn't it great? Oh, so many mosh pit folks in the Dell pit. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. I, I, hey, I mean, I, I had a bath today. I'm clean at least. I think a few people found, yeah, came here through Punky Storm. Um, so this week we're going to be, um, I need some input from you guys. Today we're going to be destroying, tearing down, <laughs> yes, yes, that, that. Uh, we're going to be tearing down some way um, the house for Big Bother 23. Um, and we need to decide what we're doing for Big Bother 24, which I plan on launching on my birthday, which is in two weeks. In case any of you had forgotten. Which I'm probably not because I keep on going on about it. But my birthday's on the 10th. Uh, so actually it's less than two weeks away. Um, so we're going to launch Big Bother 24 on the 10th. Um, I think we're going to do the blanket giveaways. Um, just chocolate pie. But I also know that you've got a... Uh, a a lot of stuff going on right now so we we don't need to do that this year yeah just chocolate pie i don't have to share it then just talk i'm look i'm a simple girl um i think <laughs> i think we're gonna do the giveaways for the blanket on the sunday because it seems like most more of you are available on a Sunday, right? So on the 14th, we'll do the blanket giveaways. Um, and I will... Okay, well, let me, let me have a think. So I think what we'll do is I'll let, I will let everyone buy a ticket during the week of my birthday with like a zero cost ticket point but just like one per person um and then on sunday we'll draw the the winners for the blankets i think that's what we're gonna do um if that sounds like it works for everyone um so launching Big Brother 24. Also, I've just reset the Project Zomboid server um, and added a couple more mods. So we're probably going to kick that off. Um, but that's why I figure if I do give, let everyone buy a ticket in the build up to the week, um, then I'm not going to make you be here. But I'm also not going to advertise that we're doing the giveaway because I really only want you guys to win. I don't want randoms to win. At least we can think of a closed system. Because it's rewarding. I don't, well, I don't, I don't mind random people coming into stream at all. But I want to support... Uh, I, I want to give back to the community what the community has given to me. Which is what the blankets are for. 
Mm, knives. You are still part of our community, Kitty. Don't you think you're not? <laughs> Pie! Knives! Fire! Um, but yeah, Project Zomboid is probably coming up. There's... Um, we're waiting on the next update for Vintage Story to drop officially. Um, and I feel like I've kind of done all I can in my current games. I still love Vintage Story. I'm not breaking up with them. Um, I just, I just feel like we've hit a limit with our, our progression. And until things change, uh, yeah yeah like i still love them but i think i need to start you know just just until things change up a little bit um so probably project zomboid will be my my obsession until vintage story updates um because i can't really do any more in my hobbit house but i don't think we're gonna have enough time to study any other big builds and i've kind of was getting frustrated with the the other one to win because I couldn't figure out what I was doing and I got my undergrad cave going so probably some Project Zomboid um so once again I'll make sure I'll do my best to make sure I tag any go live notifications in discord with a trigger warning because I know there's a couple of people in here who are a bit eh about zombies or uncomfortable about the the whole chase pro thing, so I'll try and remember to do that. Um, so I'm anxious, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so that will be open to uh, to subs, which is basically everyone in here. <laughs> um. So I've added a few more server uh, months to the server to make that a bit more comfy. I'm not adding Christmas stuff. It's cute, but I'm done with it now. The focus is all on my birthday. Yeah, suck it. Wait, no, you're calling me a nerd? Shit. Fine, whatever. I'd just like to point out that I'm wearing I felt like this was appropriate for today. You can totally be a nerd. You're all nerds with me. Yeah. Fine. Um, how dare. So. <laughs> Ali, that's amazing. <laughs> How to, how to tell we've been around Molly for, for too much, which isn't a thing, I don't think, ever, but just ending, yeah, bar mitzvahs. I haven't quite bought myself to wear it out to the store yet, mainly because I don't want to deal with angry cis-hit white men who have issues. Um, anyway, <laughs> so... So that's kind of where are we going? I don't know why I started babbling on about that, but that's kind of our our trajectory for the next few weeks. Sims, giveaways. Um zombies. Oh really? That's amazing. I, I perhaps they lost the uh, the essence of the message there. Mega Chili Mac, you're nice. You're not the sort of person to complain about someone walking around a store with a t-shirt that says cock balls, poopy pants. You got white? Oh god. <laughs> Um, so at Walmart, oh my lord. It's like, well, did you read the t-shirt? 
I mean, how do you deal with it, Ali? Ma'am, this is a Wendy's. I don't even know. Um. So yes, if any of you are interested in Project Zomboid, we are going to be firing it up. I've been holding off, but... Um, I think we're I, I've been holding off but I, I think we might fire it up soon I was going to wait until the new year but it's pretty much already the new year so I said oh lord Jesus it's a fire um So, so yeah, so t I haven't installed the mod. Um, I, babe, I did, um, I know, babe. That, that's a whole lot of balls all over the tree in front of my salad, even. Um, I have done a backup of the save for Sims 4. <laughs> um, so it will be I mean, I could probably do that. It seems like it. Everything's just thematic today. Um, I keep forgetting what I was saying. I got distracted by talking about tree walls. Oh yeah, no, so I backed up the sim save. Um, but the idea is basically we're gonna demolish the house, <laughs> uh, yeet everyone out, um, and then we're gonna restart it. So if you want to reuse your sim from this year, that's totally fine. Um, if you want to remake your sim, uh, that's totally fine. I don't really want to have to go through the process of remaking everyone's sims again though. So if you do want to do it, um, you can download the sims for free and upload it to the gallery and I will import it, but I don't. I don't have enough spoons, I think, to remake everyone's Sims. Um, and since Sims 4 is free, I feel like that's probably reasonable. Um, so yeah, but we can just reuse, like I know Sadie said that she wanted to. You do? Okay, excellent. So, like I said, we're gonna we're gonna start the new one on on my birthday, um, but there's no time limit. Um, so you can, oh, it'll just it'll be the same. Any sim, any sub can just like add their sim to the household. Um, the plan is that I will basically we'll revisit um, Big Bother Twenty Four. I don't know, like once a month, maybe a couple of times a month. We'll see how it fits in with the schedule. I keep on forgetting about it, but it's a really good thing to do when I'm feeling PMSy because it's super easy to do. Um, and if I'm feeling crampy and gross, like just putting the Sims on and watching whatever the fuck is happening. Um, but what I do need from you guys is we need to figure out what we're going to do for the house for next year. Do we? want so we could make another house like a big bother type mansion so we, before, what we've done in the past we've had a bunch of tiny houses it was like an apartment complex almost and we've had the one big house but i was wondering if maybe we should try and do something different so maybe like a village like a medieval village or a castle or 
a western so if anyone's got any ideas of a different way of like arranging you know all the functions that we have in a, an interesting way this would be the time where we can like all sort of hash out what we want to do for the year mm. <laughs> well sorry i have my blanket i'm chilly today apparently 66 is cold enough it's too cold for me so i i do have a preference um but i am not going to say what it is um also let's show you let's um i realize we're still sitting in the gaming room uh yeah that was a lot of waffle jesus christ it's been half an hour So I'll probably try and do a schedule, try and do like Sims once a month. I still want to try and do like a spa day. <laughs> um, every so often. But I keep looking at my planner and freaking out because if I plan it out and I've only do it once a month, that means we only get to play Sims 12 times next year. And I'm like, the year's already over. I'm already into 2025. <laughs> it's like a fuck I don't know uh, but yeah so give me your ideas uh, for a new build for, for Big Bother 24 also because we're changing over I'm going to um, pull the t-shirts off the merch store for the Big Bother 23 so I survived or I didn't survive Big Bother 23 those are getting going to get taken down at the end of the year so if you want one of those you need to go and get there now get them before the end of the year or maybe i can give it a few more days if people are interested uh i don't know what else there was something else i meant to mention but i can't remember what, what it was i got no idea okay should we actually play a game should we play a game Oh, also, um, this pack is free at the moment, or it was free for me, the Romantic Garden stuff pack. So if you have The Sims, Sims 4, <laughs> uh, you should, you should uh, do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't even realize, I didn't see anything about it. And also there's a Pets, My First Pets pack, I think is free as well. So check it out. Luna doing the wheel spin. Luna, were you waiting for me to finish babbling? Very kind of you. You got the pets? Yeah, I think the pets is free until like the 6th of January. Um, I didn't realize. Uh, no, this is on EA. Through the, uh, our, the EA launcher. Um... I just realized the camera is covering me up. Okay, here we go. Okay, so Luna. 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 Are you naughty? Or are you nice today? Push the wrong button. It's fine. <laughs> I'm a professional. Alright, there we go. Uh, Luna's naughty today. Surprising literally no one. Naughty. 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 <laughs> right. Oh, Ravi. Are you sure you want to do this, Ravi? I'm <laughs> like, why did you? Are you sure? All right. Let's find out. Ravi, I feel like your husband's going to be messaging me and like, what have you done to my, what have you done to my wife? Why is she swearing all of a sudden? 
must be broken. Just FYI, Ravi. You're in first equal place for naughty. Stu, Stu's like, uh uh. First place is mine. You can't have it. All right, Stu. Stu's, Stu's regained first place. Hi, Stu. Honestly, Stu's still in the lead, yeah. <laughs> Hi, hello. Um, yeah. In anyone else want to go on the naughty list? I feel like we have... I feel like if I made a naughty list, a permanent edition, everyone would just want to be on the naughty list. And I think this is more about you guys than anything else. <laughs> it is like, can I have super naughty, please? Okay, now I know the wheel is broken. Hi, Twitty! Hi, And Kitty, you just got super nice. Another Kitty, yes. You've been corrupted by all the adult content. Using swears, yeah. So yeah, we. I can confirm. Stream is broken. If if uh, Kitty here is getting super nice, I call shenanigans. All right, I seem to have lost my nice list. Please hold. Anyone else have a notebook where they just open it to like a random page to use it and then close it and then open up to another random page and then you can't find the thing that you wanted to reference? Okay, here we go. I found it. So, Kitty, what this means is my wheel is broken. Um, what this means? Oh, is it? <laughs> Like, and it's not even like, some of it's like that way, some of it's that way, some of it's that way. Um, so super nice means that I'm going to send you, if you're comfortable with it, I will send you a little treat and a sticker in the mail. But if you're not comfortable with that, then we can I can do a stinky for you instead. You get to choose. Um I know some people are uncomfortable giving out their address to weird ladies on the internet. Yes, absolutely, really. <laughs> get it, get it, get it. Uh, yes. So it's a little little treat and a sticker, but but yeah, you you can you can choose. Like, I want to, but I don't want people to feel uncomfortable. So you can let me know later, um, if you're comfortable with that or not. Ali, Ali, but you're gay. Shit, I didn't know that. What's gay? Alright, is Ali naughty or nice? Ali's nice, apparently. I like how I has it apparently like that. What does it even mean? Okay, have a good day, Pud. 
Apparently, you're nice. Um, so I need you to do exclamation mark roll in chat. Oh, 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 oh. It's apparently put. Okay, forty-eight. Oh, hey, this one's one that you might like actually. I think, uh, Pikuniku. I think is what it's called. Everyone's like, but I want to be naughty. <laughs> Thanks. All right. Prick prickly. Is prickly naughty? Oh, nice. Prickly's naughty. <laughs> It's naughty. The the wheel. No, we're not surprised. Yes, you're super naughty and nice. You're nicely naughty. <clears throat> there's there's prickly right there. And also, I'd just like to point out that not Dell is on the list. You are. Ali, I'm not good. That Ali. I guess. Okay. I don't. I don't know what's going on with this music. Okay. Um. So yeah, I was like, if I if I did a naughty list permanently, everyone would just want to be on the naughty list. Um, so I guess we'll just keep that for Christmas. So, um, shall we, shall we start playing the game maybe? So for anyone who's come in and has missed what's going on, I have no fucking idea. Um, we are about to do a big reset though on Big Bother. <laughs> um, Oh good. So Big Bother is Big Bother 24 is basically we put in Sims uh, a bunch of Sims into one lot. All the Sims are subscribers, um, which you get to choose. Um, and we throw you all in a lot together and then we just watch it unfold. It's kind of like a train wreck in a, a fish tank. And last time, I haven't played it in a while, but last time I think we had like 30 something Sims in this house. Um, so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna wrap it up. We're gonna move all the Sims out. We're gonna demolish the house. And we need to figure out what we're doing for the next build. So like I said, my ideas so far are like, a village whether it be like medieval village or like a western village um or a castle um something like that so oh hey it's luna so this is this is what we this is pyro everyone in has basically just put on like wait um, but this is what we have so at, at the moment we have it's a two-story house oh it's a mess what i don't know why, why i'm getting that um so we have a gym well no a spa and a sauna and the gym Um, 
bunch of bedrooms and laundry. Lots of bathrooms. There's Punky having a wee. They're finally watching TV. I can't remember what I did to get them to watch TV. That's Pud and Amelia. Uh, there's me watching the fire with Ravi. Um, computer room, kitchen, and dining. Is Kitty? Is Babe? Isa Hearts? Is is also Kitty? Flint. Daphne. It's Necro, I think. Um, so yeah, we just throw this Ali. He's probably needing to wee. Hey. Oh. I what the hell is Emilio doing? Oh, he's jamming out. Alright. Um so yeah, this is basically what happens. Uh, it's Echo. Still alive because death I I did some poking about and managed to get get a ghost spawned. So yeah, this is what we do. This is this is Big Bother 23. And um So so we're gonna Feels a little bit sad. Demolish everything and start again. See, I don't think I made all of these bedrooms and I don't even think we needed all of them. Half of them weren't used. Um Oh, these littles. Jamming out. So, so yeah, I don't I don't know yet. I don't know what we're doing. It's it's far too entertaining. I like how Echo is just having a snooze on the couch. Oh well, we had a garden. Where's the pea shrub? <gasps> Where did the pea shrub go? So yeah, the plan is we're going to do oh, what's going on here? Ghost massages? Maybe? Or maybe I got rid of it because I was tired of people choosing the pea shrub over the <laughs> over the, the normal one. Um There's toast. Toast and kitty. So I think if we we set this is Sadie. So that's why I forgot Sadie is like really fucking ripped. Um, Sadie said she was gonna redo hers. So what we're gonna do is you can tell we had a few fires there. Um. We should do like a last, a last minute tour, right, of the house. Who's in there? Someone's in the science lab. <laughs> Fire! Mmm. Deep tissue would be tricky as a ghost, for sure. Oh, it was Punky in there. Okay, Ravi.
doing the science. Yeah, well known stargazers. All right. God, this place was such a pain in the ass to um, build. Okay. I'm like I'm I'm really reluctant to to abolish this. I've kind of got attached apparently. But also how much fun is it going to be making a new place? No one's given me any feedback on what to build for the new big bother house. Yeah. You did? Flint. Flint wanted a castle. That's <laughs> true. Flint mentioned, when I was talking to him yesterday, Flint mentioned a castle and then having it set so that roles would be assigned by like random. So we'd have like the village idiot, uh, Etc. Etc. The blacksmith, but I there's no jobs. Build a compound. I wish we could all live in. You all want to live in tree houses? I want to live in an Ewok village. I don't, I've tried to do that before and it doesn't work. Not really. Okay, so. <laughs> like I can, I can build houses and put trees on them. But everyone's already got their personalities made. I don't know if, if there were like roles that you could assign, but I don't know how that would work. Uh, I, I think all of us are a little village idiot. This is a dead by daylight. And I think as well in the next iteration, we are going to just keep one ghost. Um, because it was getting a little bit problematic, I think. Well, not problematic, but it was just a bit stressful trying to figure it out. Right there. It's always been Flint, yeah. So I think we'll keep it to... to ghosts. Let people respawn in. If they want. And we'll probably end up having to have a DNR as well because last time there were a few people who were like they just didn't want their sims to be regenerated or reintroduced um so i think what we need to do first is evict the family oh i feel so mean oh my lord Everyone is just like snoozing on the couch. Jabine, laundry tool. 
Oh. Oh, man. I don't even know what's going on half the time in here. Okay, so I've backed up the save, so I don't know why I'm so reluctant about this. Wait, why is Luna stressed? Oh, Luna's stressed from work. So we do have a backup. I've actually got two backups of this save in case something goes terribly wrong. So we're going to evict the household. get in there to set a fire Logar, me a robot. shut up okay so now because I evicted them how do you move a family in oh here we go Um, we're gonna move you into this one. They'll be like, what? How does this even work? Okay, let's just make sure everyone's moved in there. That was the thing I was worried about. And what I'm gonna do is start another household called Big Bother 24. And then you guys can, we can move your new sims in there. So. That is everyone. Okay. The, the whole heckin' mess. I'm guessing there's only... Wait, one, two, three, four. Uh, eight spawn points. You have merged. Th this particular Ravi Emily compilation is interesting as is the hunky dell will conglomeration that's creepy as fuck okay Yes, so um, if you are a sub and you would like your sim, like to have a sim representing you, however you like, in Big Bother 24, Sims 4 is free to play. So just with the base game, you can make a sim, uh, you can upload it. I have a video on explaining how to do it, um, and then we will import it. Um, so. Um, yes, Stu, if that is something that you would like to be a part of, and then we're just going to revisit it over the air. Um, I want to put a link for this. There is... I don't, I don't know how to navigate my own YouTube channel. It's fine. How do I, how do I YouTube again? Oh, here. Okay. So if you are interested and you would like to upload your Sims, here is a guide on how to do it. 
Um, I, I recorded that myself. It's very fancy and professional. Or something. Oh god, why did I put that over there? Everything is fine. Yay! So we'll kick it off on... Oh, you've got... I mean, you've got all the time. There's no rush. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, Sims 4 is free, I believe, on Steam and through EA. You don't need any expansion packs or anything. And you can make your Sim how you want to look. Uh, you don't have to make it how you currently look. You can make it to fit your aspirations and goals or however you want. There will be no nipples babe no nip knops no cheesy nip knops um but yes you can just do whatever you like so we're going to go over here and then i need to find Here. Alright, I am going to... Hey. I'm going to take all the money. I don't even know where it all came from. I'm just gonna take a million dollars and run with it. Okay. Whoa. Oh, wait. How do I? Oh. Okay, we're gonna have to do this a different way. I think I'm gonna have to make a new sim to make it work. Oh god! Why is that one in there? Please hold, Daisy's having a fit. Well, that's a quote. <laughs> oh, it's Flint music. Hang on, I want to see how this unfolds. Where's this guy? Oh, it is. Hey. Oh, it's a table. 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 Oh, it's a table.
What the fuck? Okay. That was something that was entertaining. Oh, we have ads shortly, by the way. Apparently, ads in 30 seconds. Maybe. Wait, where did these guys go? Oh, they oh, oh no, everyone's just gone to sit at the park and do cross stitch. That's really cute. Wait, wait. Why is Punky embarrassed? Oh no, this is the problem. See, I get sucked in. All right. So I'm going to make a new me. So I can make a new household. I, I've forgotten how to play this. Okay. Oh. Hey. Oh. Okay. Um. Fam, fam, no baby, no milk. Yes, I want to be able to stand up. No, none. No interest in any bullshit. Thank you. Oh shit, that's cute. That's a good start. I actually kind of like her already. Love that hairstyle. Wait, what? Okay, now we have ads on 30 seconds? Yeah, I kind of like I don't I don't like the blue eyeshadow. The face isn't quite right, but I like everything else. For me. For a me sim. Oh, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Very 2000. See, I, I was like going back another couple of decades there. It's not me. But honestly, I kind of, you know what, it's fine. There's so many cool hairstyles. Um, all right, let's look at the outfits that's randomly. Oh no, that's cute. Wait, that's formal. Sure, athletic. Sleep. Those put those sweatpants are so fucking gnarly. It's ridiculous. What is this? I'm good with that. Okay, so not too bad. Not too bad. Yeah. There's some really cute glasses. She looks like it. Okay, now she looks like a glasses model and looks nothing like me, but that's okay. Okay, and what? 
woman laughing with glasses stock photo Woman laughing, woman laughing with yogurt because she can poop real good. This is okay. This is uh, Miss Beanie Fiber 2024. <laughs> Fiber, it's the shit. The funny thing is, I don't even really mind the shoes too much. Oh, <gasps> kitty cats! Okay, I like that outfit. Those those pants are not right though. Oh no, that's cute too. What the fuck? Why? Look, why is this happening? Oh, you know what? I just realized the random everything kind of gave her a cute shape. That's really cute! Oh, I like that. Alright. It's vile. A bow. What is the what are these? Oh lord. Perfect. Oh, that's cute. Look at the little sash. Okay. <clears throat> uh this is sleepwear. That, that'll do, but get rid of the shoes. Uh, party. Girl, no. Like, immediately, that's better. Wait. <sighs> okay. Oh, that's cute. Oh, is this from the new pack? I think this is from the new pack. Yeah, it is. Aw, oh, that's really cute too. How did I not see all these before? The little bunnies? What does that pack? Uh. I am. Boots. I really miss my my ankle boots. <laughs> He's got such a cute little shape. All right. Party. Uh, I mean, I guess that's okay. Probably ditch the hat though. Not, not taking the hat. Oh no, I forgot about there being, like, different outfits. Oh, that's so cute! <laughs> cute! Okay. 
Hot weather. Those are not happening. What is this pack? I've got outfits here that I don't recognize. Okay, perfect. Cold weather. Always, always leggings because that's just how I roll. Comfort. All about comfort. That is something. That is, that's a lot. This is winter. Why is Daisy doing so much walking? Oh, hey, there's a pajama top to match the other one. I don't know. I don't know what I want. Honestly, that looks comfy though. Oh, that's kind of cute. I even, you know what? I dig the boots too. I like the boots. But not in blue. Um. Oast. Oh, she doesn't have, um, yeah, chunky sweater and leggings. Definitely. Oh, I could have had a pirate, which, <gasps> yes. How did I miss out these? It's really cute. Chubbs is good boy. Um, it's not there a setting somewhere to apply. It to all appearances. Paper. What is that? Oh, my hair fell off. Um. Oh, wait. I thought there was a setting that you could make it so that every hairstyle is applied to every. I wonder if to do makeup for all of them. I guess not. I could have sworn there was a setting for applying hair to every outfit. What? What is this? Oh, shit. What? You can have multiple outfits? I don't- oh, that's too much. Yeah, I, I vaguely recall there being something there, but oh, I don't know.
What is that? Um, sure. Sure. Uh, all right. Wait, what? Oh, that's party. Uh, there's so much detail. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. I'm not gonna spend hours messing around with this. I could, but I'm not gonna. Um. You. Sure. I do love all the earrings they've added. Ice creams. Yes. Okay. Uh it, it is tempting to make her Miss Beanie Five for twenty twenty four. Obviously knitting. Perfect. Okay. That's right. Not letting me put in a there. Oh wait, likes. Everything. Tell me, Yibs, partner in both. <laughs> I like all of the things, but they does make your Sims happier. Oh, 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 I just noticed there's a limit on how many things you can enjoy now. Yes, I like rocket science. Okay, there we go. Okay, actually, we're gonna call this the Big Bother 24. remember how this works
Ow. Oh. Hi, Crazy, how you doing? Okay, there we go. I'm good, thank you. Okay, so new year, new me and stuff. I didn't see that weird arrow on her back. Oh, hey. So now we are we gonna save again? Um so uh, last year Um Last Christmas Uh actually this year but we we're running it this year we had a event in the sims where everyone had a sim based on their sub and we all threw them in the same house and then we just watched shit unfold Bakma, I saw that ping <laughs> um so we're doing the, we're doing getting prepped to reset it so we're creating a new household we're going to do a new build and potentially if I can figure out how burn the house down from this year. Hi, back my Um so I was just making a new me to build the household around. So now we need to remember how to play this game. Okay, we need to visit here. So I've moved all the sims out. Now we need to visit this house and see if I can see fires. I haven't installed the mod. I don't know if oh god the camera angles are gonna take something to oh don't skinny dip I think because I'm it, this is in isn't my house I can't move into it. Okay. I'm not allowed to just walk into someone's house randomly, apparently. <laughs> the game's like, okay. Um. Wait, no, I said free real estate. Oh my god, I have so many treats, Ali. <laughs> so many treats. Yeah, that was a cute little house. I don't think I could fit 30 something Sims into that house though. Hmm. 
Mmm, void water. All right, now. How do we stop fires? Oh no, that's bollocks. I thought that was a quick fire starting thing. I basically want to burn this house down to the ground. Sims for burn a house down. Well, there's no one in here anymore. We didn't start the fire. Oh, wait, I have MC. You're, you're welcome. I have... Oh. Hey. Why aren't you... Why is it not loading? How to start a fire? I may have to poke at the master controller mode. My sim's just like, yes, I've got this house to myself. It's amazing. Uh, don't know if this will work. Master controller is not showing. Why is master controller not showing? No. Oh, it'd help if I gave it a reference for Sims 4, huh? These are things that we need to, we need to iron out. So that this works. Okay, command center is on. It should work. Watch a gaming live stream. I have completely forgotten how to play this game.
feel like I'm, it's a mod issue. And it's for Master Controller. I probably haven't updated it in a while. Oh, yes. It was an update a couple, a week ago. That'll do it. All right, please hold as I update my mods because I didn't do that before stream because I'm very organized. So organized. Professional streamer. Hi, Carter. Wait, out of how many professional Kiwis? Yeah, 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 that's exactly it. All right. Must exit the game first. Yeah, come hang out in this room. Thanks oh, for the light. Hello. Hello. All right, command center package. Command center. TS for script. No, that was a career. I don't want that one. That one. Hey, hey. Is that it? MC command sent. No, the log gets generated. Don't care about the last exception report. All right, let's see if that worked. Yeah, I just looked at it and I was like, oh yeah, <laughs> the date was December the, f there was an update needed for December the 5th. Chucky! Hey, this is Southbound F, bringing you your wellness check. Maybe you need to take your vitamins, maybe you need to take your medication. Have you had any water today? Maybe you just need to stand up and take a deep breath, you know, clear your head a little bit. Just remember to take care of yourself. You're worth it. Oh, I do need to take my vitamins. Thank you. Hi, Jackie. Huh? Are you Miss Who? <laughs> Daphne? Oh. I was playing a cute game the other day. All right. Hey, this isn't working on the scene. Uh, there we go. Okay, Jackie. We're gonna find out if you're naughty or nice. Just so you understand. If it comes up naughty, your name goes on the list. And if it's nice, you get a steam key. Okay? It's naughty. <laughs> Chucky, Chucky, Chucky. Wait, wait, wait. Any minute now. Any minute. There's Chucky. Is Chucky on the naughty list? Ah, here we go. It's a, it is very good company. Okay. The mod is working now. Hey. Oh, wait. Okay, so somewhere in here...
Not me. I'm a good girl. Debug commands and cheats. Enabled. Okay. Apparently this will let me just set fires. I can literally just run around and click on things and set fires. Uh, this is me who's not on the naughty list talking about setting things on fire. I said, oh Lord Jesus, it's a fire. Maybe. That's all right, there's other methods we can try to set a fire to things. Poppy doesn't taste great after my vitamins. See, destroy object. Oh. Oh, I see. So it's debug actions. Interesting. So I can destroy and reset. <laughs> Ali. I think that's what I was looking at. Yeah, no, it doesn't work. That's what I just tried to do. I get break, destroy. Unless, will that cause a fire? I don't know if that'll cause a fire. I think we're gonna have to. Uh, I know exactly the piece of furniture to use for this. Oh, I've forgotten how to. Here. This this couch. This thing may be the most flammable furniture item in the game. Okay, this is fine. I'm fixing a TV on one side. Do we need a rug? Hang on, let's get a rug. Let's just make things more flammable. Here. Okay, which is gonna go wrong first? the fire
Yeah, I do. Oh, you know what? I think I I think I upgraded the fireplace so it wouldn't set things on fire. Um, but yeah, I do have the spa day pack. can't get to it. What's that? Oh, hey, you can use it to summon Xander. Okay, come on. Shouldn't be this hard to start a fire. Don't stand there. This is supposed to be the most flammable couch in the game. Bakma. Um, what's in the sim pack in the spa day pack? Maybe we just need more fireplaces. I think the one the only thing is oh, incense? Um, is I love that you're researching this, by the way. Um, there is a mod for this. Oh, um. It's called the Roastem Toastem Campfire. Rocks of, oh here we go, Rocks of Fire. This looks safe. This, this is totally gonna be fine. Oh god. My issue here is the fire alarm. Not that I'm on fire, it's the fire alarm. Maybe stick. Hey, excuse me, I'm trying to burn the house down.
Right, that's it. Locking the door for everyone but the firemen. All right, I know I have a fire alarm somewhere, but where did I put it? All right, let's get rid of these smoke detectors because they're clearly ruining all the fun. Ah, this, that's the fire suppression system, I think. Uh, possibly? I just, look, I just want to set the world on fire. I just want to set the world on fire. Alright. This time, lock for everyone but me. Lock for everyone but me. With it, oh, really? There's a, that's a thermostat in there. That just makes me want to play a Fallout. Evocative lemon. Yes, let's have an evocative lemon. Oh, there we go. This interaction is unavailable because of a fire on the light. Oh, wait. Hey, stop it. Come back. Why are you leaving? We're just getting to the good bit. God damn it. Look, she's happy. Okay, there's still fire suppression somewhere. Happy because she was saved by firefighters. Excellent. It really is. Well, it's not near the fire. That's a very pretty... There we go. Well, that didn't work. I like her concern is... Oh no, I stink! Okay, look, this is just not working. Why do we still have sprinklers in here? I don't think I've got any more... Oh! 
I don't think I have any more sprinklers. Hmm. Oh no. All right, well, I did find a mod. Let's just cut to the chase. I did find a mod on how to start a good fire. Wait, more deadly and intense fire. Flavor one, two, three. Is different flavor fires? Oh, okay, we want three. Okay, so it's just a package file. And then how do I do this? Mod changes how deadly or an intense a fire is once it's started. All right, perfect. This is, uh, this is important testing for science. Um, I'll drop you straight in there. So we are now testing the more deadly intense fire mod. But I will just double check and make sure that the, um, that Stu, that your, your sim is up there. I'm looking forward to doing, doing this again next year. I'm already panicking that there's only potentially like a dozen sim streams to happen. Oh, I've got a bunch of people saved up here. Okay. Uh, I don't... oh wait. The bearded? I don't know if it's gonna be... Item name? Hashtag account ID. Oh, just the bearded. Here we go. <gasps> Yay! Perfect. All right. So when we get the new house built, then I can just like import it and it's nice and easy. What is that one? Oh, here we go. Now let's see if we get some more fire. I think one of the other problems is that there's a limitation. I could. Um, there's a, a limitation on how fire spreads in the game. Uh, you can make a new cow. Oh shit. I'd say the mod's working. Yeah, no, absolutely. Everyone's welcome to, to make a new cow. Uh, a new sim for themselves. This feels a lot like Project Sunway.
I don't know why it feels like Project Zomboy, but it does feel like Project Zomboy. Oh, that's al alarming. Yeah, so if anyone wants to remake their sim, um, that's totally fine. I'm not going to introduce any sims until the 10th of January. I'm not going to add them until the week of my birthday. Um, or let me know if my frame rate starts to suffer, by the way. I'm very tense right now, but also happy. I mean, it's definitely spreading. I would say the mod is working. Can confirm mod still works. Or, uh, this is Flavor 3, uh, Intense Fire starting mod. I like how my sim's just like, I'm out. I'm out. I'm gone. She's Ooh, cheering! She's genuinely clapping and cheering at the house being on fire. definitely spreading. I don't think the sprinklers are working. I don't know if there's a... Can I make it? Oh, I can make it go in. No, what are you doing? I didn't say go there. She's very uncomfortable. Oh, you know what? My favorite part in all this. Look at Grogu. How do you hide the UI in this? Is it F10? Perfectly fine. Oh, there we go. Whoop. Oh, oh. It 
It's taken me years. To do this. Hey. Oh, did I break the game? No. I should have worn red. It would have accessorized with the fire better. Um, there any ads are starting soon, but I'm not sure quite when. Oh no, I'm missing the season premiere of my favorite TV show. Honestly, I feel like it could do better. Like as intense fires go, this is pretty boring and slow. Now I'm going to have to remember to make sure I take the mod off. Oh god. Oh my no, there's so many clips. Um, I have to make sure I take the mod off before we get into it further. Oh, I added a couple of extra emotes for the new year. Does anyone have any marshmallow? Ads in 30 seconds. You probably won't miss anything though. Oh no, apparently she's super tired. Oh, oh. Sure. You've got marshmallows? Perfect. All right, we have ads. I'm just going to let it burn. I'm going to go wee. I'll be right back. Oh no. <laughs> All right. Drax. <laughs> this is fine. Oh, right, I at least found one of the new emotes. Yay! It's okay. This is a planned burn. I mean, you knew it had to happen one day, right? is just like clipping like a fiend so the the plan is if anyone's tuning in and wondering what the fuck is going on there um we are burning down the sims uh the the big bother house of 2023 this is a cathartic end to big bother 23 and then we're going to demolish everything that's left, do a new build for Big Bother 24, and so anyone who's a sub can have a sim in the Big Bother 24 house. So you can, uh, if you already had a sim, you can add that. 
right, we can add that back in, or you can make your own sim, because the base game of Sims 4 is free. And you can create your own sim. <laughs> Hi, Wally! Um, and then, uh, yeah. I mean... I blame Ali. Wiley. That's totally fine. I had a little bit of anxiety after watching the fire spread in Project Zomboy. But this is the intention. I'm safe! <laughs> Molly has given Gal a snow globe! I'm safe in here. I'm not safe anymore. Um, so yeah, we it, it's a cathartic end to Big Brother 23. Uh, so everyone with a sub is welcome to create a sim for Big Brother 24. Um, when you do your character creation, you can choose um, relationship interests as well. So you can... Oh no, my meanwhile my sim is overly tired and just weed on the floor. It's fine. <clears throat> that is a lot of wee. Like. Wow. I know. Well, you know what? This is what it's like at the end of stream. <clears throat> you really, really have to go. Um, here we go. I kind of wish it was spreading further. I. <laughs> I need more fire in my fire. This is already a fire on the lot. I can't make it. Um, I can't add more. <laughs> Somehow, as well, the TV is still going. Also. Grogu is still fine. Grogu is like carrying this. <sighs> Which I kind of love. I think, I think Simdao was trying to fix the TV, but it got distracted. <laughs> Ali, Ali's still posting clips. Burger is like, yes, my pretty spread. Oh God. What have I done? Huh? Oh god! Hey! <laughs> this bird don't know what happened there! I don't know! <laughs> I, don't, I don't know! The camera got a bit confused! Um... Ravi, you leave stream for five minutes and look what happens. <laughs> I was feeling lonely. <laughs> I really do need to make a channel trailer.
We're recording now. I'm waiting for my frame rate to start tanking. Grogu's doing pretty good. Oh yeah, it's spread pretty far. It's interesting how it's spreading actually because I think ordinarily fire in this game doesn't tend to jump from room to room um, in order to sort of make the game less terrible if fires start. My Sam is just standing there in a puddle of her own wee, exhausted watching her house burn. She's not cheering anymore. I'm kind of sad about that. Uh, I found a mod that dials it up. It's really pretty. <laughs> Thanks. Oh my god. I was gonna have like <laughs> the most clips. Yeah, I found a mod called. Uh, what's it called? More Deadly Intense Fire. And it, it just changes the behavior of the fire spread. <laughs> yes. We are doing this for a reason. I mean, other than the fact that I en enjoy it. No. There's there's nothing vague about the stream title. Oh, uh, the the mod title. Stream title may be a little vague. And yet somehow I still feel chilly. I don't know how this works. Wait! Yay! Thank you for the follow! Welcome in! <laughs> uh, this isn't... This isn't a normal stream. I know. Well, the thing is, I am feeling like I'm watching the fire, and <sighs> it's not spreading fast enough, though. How is the grass burning, though? Okay. So, welcome, welcome to stream. This is a perfectly normal everyday. Wait, snark? Never. Will it trade? Will it go up a level? I wonder if it'll go upstairs. Will we find out? Uh, yes. So we are currently wrapping up um our Sims Sims for Big Bother. Uh, 
uh, on a scale of what? On a scale of one to whatever. Um, yes, we're wrapping up Sims Sims 4 Big Bother 23. And uh, yes, we can do that. Getting ready to start Sims Sims 4 Big Bother 24. I have a something that might be able to maybe I can repurpose the 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 love one oh, I wouldn't ever use that don't bother bother what have I got here Oh, here we go. Snark, really? Exclamation mark, snark. Hey. I could, I mean, I could speed the game up. It's supposed to be a random percentage. Okay, it was. It just started with a hundred. Jesus Christ. Actually, that's not a bad idea, Stu. That was easy. Easy to do. Okay, now now Ravi's turning into a firebug. <laughs> okay, super fast fire. Go go get it! Fire! I'm still keeping an eye on my uh, my bit right here. It's so pretty. I feel like the sprinklers are winning. Or maybe the fires are just running out of fuel. Yeah, so far I think we're leaning towards a a village for for the next build. Um, so it's just a matter of a theme for. The, oh, she's passed out again. Wait, who's this? Someone's just come to watch the house burn. She's like, ew, you stink. Um. So yeah, we'll have all of the Sims in here. Oh, she's done it again. And uh, but not with the fire. I will remove the fire mod before we do it next time. I think the next one I will maybe move the um Oh 
Joker is it? Hey! Oh no, it's raining! Cheating! I might not use the dryers in the next one. Just because they were kind of an annoying. Oh, he here's the counter for last year. I can't believe the rain cheated. Maybe half of them were from the dryer. And the rest were electrical. Ooh, kitchen's going up. Really curious to see if the fire will go upstairs. I don't think it will. Um, we'll definitely keep the the house fire counter and the death counter. But yeah, I don't I don't think we'll we'll put the dryer in because it's just like it's it's funny, but it's also kind of annoying. Um. I don't know if I have off the grid. Is there a way to to check? Oh, I bet there is. Hang on. Oh, no, I... <laughs> Apparently I can't build and decorate in my house when it's on fire. Some bullshit. I feel like maybe... I, I have enough stuff to um to go off grid. I don't know how you see what you've got though. Eco lifestyle. Expansion pack. Is it an expansion pack or a stuff pack? Okay, it's not an expansion. Game pack. Not a game pack. or off the grid. I don't think it's a specific pack, actually. Yeah, I think there is some stuff. I think you can... Yeah, I've got... I have cottage living. That's right, because it's actually a... a setting for the lot that you can toggle. Well, the, you know what? That would make sense if we did, like, a medieval thing. To have it off the grid would make sense, right? Ooh. So I suppose it kind of would with an western one as well. 
I think I'm kind of leaning more towards like medieval historic type thing just because then I can live out my dream of being a, a princess. It's really loud when you get in. Yes. The, 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 the trappings of history with the comforts of modernity. That's, that's where I'm at. Oh, whoops. I was like, why is it slowed down so fast? Do we, do we think we've proven a point? Should I just like nuke it now? Are we going to let it burn out? So for like a village, we could have like the the pub with the or the inn, and then I would do stables. Oh, I don't. Oh, I don't have the I don't have the horses pack, but I'm worried that the horses one would actually was a problem because the sims do a really bad job of autonomously caring for creatures which is why i had to take daisy off this pack off this build because the sims just weren't taking care of her and she was just like running around and it was breaking my heart oh wait apparently wait what who are all these people oh the neighbors came over to welcome me and I'm like, my house is on fire and I'm lactose intolerant and apparently very tired. Ew, this global. I don't I don't know what's up with this one. Oh. Meanwhile, the neighbors are like, well, this is a shitty welcome. They're, they're irritated that I'm not there to take their cake. Like, I can't do anything anyway. Even if I wanted to, I couldn't welcome them to the lot. I'm like, man, this place stinks. I think we're gonna let it burn the kitchen and who's this coming over oh no one this other sim keeps on coming over here and doing the same thing why is she hard for i don't understand what's going on oh no everyone needs oh no the neighbors are weeing themselves we're all just Missing ourselves? Wait. What is going on? Oh no, she just passed out into a puddle of her own way. I think I broke the game. Oh, I, I was like, I, I don't know what's happening. I think what's happened, okay, what I think has happened is when your sim moves into a house, there's this event that triggers where your neighbors welcome you and they bring cake. And it's like your first interaction with other sims. But because I'm outside the lot and the lot's on fire, no interactions can happen, so I think the Sims have just got stuck. Oh. 
So wait, I can tell her there's a fire? Like, that's literally the only thing I can say to any of them. I can't talk to them at all. Derek's like, oh man, I've got heartburn. I'm like, dude, my house is house burn. Okay. Well, we've been watching the house burn for an hour. I, I feel like maybe that's enough. Do we, do we think? Maybe? Wait. Oh, oh no! No, 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 no. <laughs> um, I unlocked the gate! Um... Guys? Right. <laughs> I'll see you later, Brickley. Oh. Well, that... I, apparently I died. <laughs> so I guess that's a good end to the fire. I died of starvation. Okay. So shall we start building the new place? <laughs> well. <sighs> It was fun while it lasted. Okay, I think I think that'll do. We've watched the world burn for an hour together. That was kind of fun. I'm disappointed actually, I should have left the gate open because there's no way the firefighters could have got in there at that point. Right? I don't think so. Oh no, this is a, the this is where the fire started. Oh no, now I'm on fire. Notifications up the left side here. I'm curious to see. Fire, 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 fire.
so silly. Oh, am I out? No, I'm not on fire again. I have- this is- this is ridiculous. This list on the left. Oh. Okay, now she decides it's time to leave. I know I said we were done with burning the house down. But I'm intrigued to see- well, see, I don't have any sprinklers now. <laughs> and, and that's a wrap, folks. I don't know that there's anything to be gained from... <laughs> oh, I really, I just want to keep on watching it burn. Um, but... I don't think there's any point. But also I can't stop. Stand there. <laughs> it seems like it's spreading more now. Oh, oh, I need to get some good screenshots. Could be a bit triggery for people. Probably should have thought about that first. They still think we're in the event. I think this guy is just like. this fire come from? I didn't start it! He is cool as a cucumber. I think I've found a fellow pyromaniac. Fluffy! Oh, it is spreading much further than before. Some people just want to watch the world burn. A apparently I am one of them. <gasps> what if we could have a fire all the way around the pool? It would look so pretty. The fire and then the water in the middle. Yeah. Do everything, bam, bam, bam. Now is the season. That's how it goes, right? Bam, bam, bam. This fire is definitely spreading better than the last one. Okay. 
Enough of that. <laughs> I just realized the birthday tune is playing now. Happy birthday to me. It's a hundred and three. <sighs> Happy birthday, dear Dal. Happy birthday to me. Yeah, the music is interesting. I did I did turn it down a little bit. I realized on the vault it was a bit high. <laughs> Doom. Perfect. Okay, well, let's um let's stop. Oh. Oh. I think it's actually got to play itself out. Because I can't get back into... I can't do anything when there's a fire. Other than exit the game. <laughs> I I can. Are you naughty or nice? Funky. Funky's naughty. The list doesn't lie. <laughs> toast? Is toast naughty or nice today? Toast is man, it is landing a lot on naughty. Toast, toast weaver. There you are. <laughs> hey, I'm naughty. Like, I think at this point you can- oh no. <laughs> at this point, I think I have to actually go back to an autosave before I started the fire. You're gonna make it taller now? Perfect. Um, yeah, I think I have to go back to an earlier autosave because the, the game is like basically on hold until the fire is finished now. It's doing a pretty good job. All right. Game is currently in a state where saving isn't possible. I've had my fun. A little bit. I did back up everything. So, it's okay. What I need to do actually is go through all the sims and upload them all individually. Now I think I broke the game again. Oh, Toast, I... I did... 
a uh, reset. I did get the reset on the Project Zomboy server done. And I added a couple more mods. Um, yeah. So uh, I added um, the container management one because I think that lets you like do auto deposit ma matching things. So you can walk up to a box that's labeled as like food and it'll put food in there. And has been red was one that I thought would be useful because it actually gives you a marker and better sort, I think, is another one that I added. Um, I put a list in Discord as well. Um, but if there's anything else you want to add in, but I was thinking I might start in, is it Riverside this time? Yeah, Riverside. I, I really think I broke the game. It doesn't normally spend this time, this much time in uh, loading. Don't you make me force close you. I broke the Sims. Ah, uh, hello, task manager. So much fire. In task. Bye bye. All right, there we go. Now we're going to remove the mod more deadly and intense fire. The mod is deleted. It is not in game anymore. So I think what we're going to do is an off the grid village. Like medievalish ish so there'll be like an inn and some homes and some workspaces titles kitty death test rip kitty no remains cheese Does that count? Okay. A theme for the first quarter. Cheese. Uh. Yan? How is it not a theme? I mean, cheese is self care. Right? Baby cheeses. Okay. 24 bills. Okay. So, Big Bother Farm. Um, we're going to make it off the grid.
Yeah. Off the grid. So. Oh, there's no plumbing. The slot is not connected to the utility grid. Most objects who use power or water will not function as expected. What? Okay, what's this, the difference then? Oh, no, we don't want to do that. Yes. Okay, so off the grid, uh, but also we want... Um... Homie, Vable, Red Acoustics, Natural Light. I can't have fast internet. Oh, what if the neighbors have really good Wi Fi? Oodles of fresh air make for bracing. Okay, sure. Um, 24. All right, this is the bit where I get stuck. So, we're gonna go for... Um... What, what building we need an inn? And then... Like, well, actually, the bedrooms could be above the inn, right? So, we need it. Actually, we need a gatehouse first. Whoopsie. Hey, put that. So, a gatehouse. Vaguely. We go to enter the town thing. Like that. So entry to the town, the walled town of, I don't know, something. Um, this is going to be the in slash. I have to make it larger. Proximity alert. Yes. Vessel approaching. Hey, yes. The yes, vessel yes, yes. We, we are uh we've just spent two hours burning the house to the ground for Big Bother 23. And we are now building Big Bother 24. Um we are doing it off the grid, so no electricity or plumbing. And Oh no, the Sims are fine. The Sims are fine. I only burnt the house. I've saved all the Sims. All right, we're going to do like a medieval village. So we've got... Don't know, a building here. A, a building of some form here. No, I did not burn the... I didn't burn any of the sims. Any of the sub sims, they're all fine. I guess, I've never played off the grid, so I don't really know what's to be expected. Um, like walled garden. <gasps> I 
I guess build one thing at a time, right? Medieval village. So the first building I'm going to do is... thing no it's all right i mean there's there's a lot of stuff going on and i've got a bunch of perfect things for it yeah we're gonna build the tavern first oh that's really pretty what is that from I think that was from another one of those free sets. Hmm. Oh hey, apparently I remember the remember buttons. Alright, maybe that. So I really like though that. Love that. Why is that so pale? It's the same set. Weird. Okay, we'll try and do a few a few different things and see what we like the most. That. Do Yeah, me too. It's really fun. Urgh. That's a sliding door. I feel like this door might be the best. Oh, that's awful. But we're definitely going to use this rustic archway. Gonna use the heck out of the rustic archway because I really like that. Oh hey, apparently I'm remembering controls without meaning to. Alright, so let's get rid of that so I can actually see. You can overlap them, yeah. Um, the only thing is because they're doors, they do have um, like they won't all be functional. So I can make them clip, but then like every other one won't actually work. But there are pillars that you can add in. Um, that kind of still yeah because they've got pathing through them but there's there's clips here uh, towers that we but uh, pillars towers I can word so we've got wood to use oh shit it's right there I 
How cute is that? Oh my god, I love that so much. Ooh. Well, that's going to make everything much, much easier. Fuck yes. Oh my god, there's a stone set too. What the heck? Alright. Wait, did that do anything? Oh, it did. Alright. So that's all, all those textures are coming from that one pack. They really not give us matching packs. Jungle adventure. There we go. Oh, what's right there? Fuck yes. I love those textures so very much. Alright, so... Oh no, why is this so cute? What the fuck? I got these curved walls now. How do you do curved walls? Like that, like that, look! <gasps> curved rooms. Oh my god, yes. I'm so excited. Okay. I love those windows so much. very jungle I don't know how it's jungle adventures but it's perfect I'm still not sure on the door there now I'm intrigued to see what we've got for floor textures nice rustic wooden planks Yes. This build set's so pretty. This the Jungle Adventures pack was given away for free last year, I think. Hey, Nizio. Oh, that's too tall. A 
obviously we need thatch, thatch? Mm, shingles shingles for the pub those wins shingle all the pub I don't know what... What's that? Oh, is that supposed to be like... Mildewy? Oh, okay. Well, that'll do. Alright. And the light mapping here is weird. Oh, you know what? Let's save as... Big Father 24. So the plan is we're going to have the pub on the ground floor. For that. Oh my, look at the light mapping on that. That is beautiful. God, I'm a dork. But honestly, that's gorgeous. So, pub on the ground floor, in rooms above, and then I think we'll have this lead to a cookhouse to the size, like a courtyard with a cookhouse. I think that was like the one thing that the that I noticed from the one from this year. Oh, 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 oh. Are you sure? All right, let's find out. It's Drax, naughty or nice. Very strong language for you, Ravi. You knew the risk. It's it's the same odds as my trick or treat wheel. It's just a different color, different skin. Ravi's just salty because she's in second place for naughty. Yeah, but there's no weighting. There's no weight preference. The weights aren't. No, I haven't messed with the weights. So I, it's a conspiracy. Look. Ravi's all out here like I'm a nice, kind, family friendly, wholesome for streamer and then comes in my chat and swears and says naughty things. Stu is still the leader. Yeah, Stu got naughty again today. Stu's in the lead there with, with six entries on the naughty list. Followed by Ravi with five. The badge of honor for some, you know. You should be proud of it, Ravi. I bet. All right, I think we're gonna do. We're going to do the bar here at this end. 
and then a fireplace and tables and then kitchen and cookhouse and then stairs at the back leading up to the rooms I reckon Wait, wait. Oh, right. Okay, that's fine. We'll see. See how we go with that. So let's just loosely put some furniture down. Look at this! Oh my gosh. These are from the romantic pack that just unlocked. Oh, they're so pretty! I like how they've added some marble with moss. Yeah, this is from the free stuff that, that that I found this morning. Yellow roses. Oh, look at that. That's so pretty. We need that in our pub. Okay, we're going to have to use some move objects. On. We're going to have to use some placement sheets for sure. Oh, here we go. Change the time of day so I can see a bit better. Handy. Uh, here, bar. I think we may have to hide, like, bury the bar in another, like, in a set of counters. It's easy, you just wait. That's really cute. So the the off the grid means no um no plumbing or electricity. Maybe this one will work. Oh, hey. Hello? Oh, there we go. No, I don't like the wood texture there. Um, all right, let's look for some counters. Now I'm just like, but none of them match. Traditional, medieval, 
metal counters. I think that will do for a bar. So, because you can actually put, um, stools up against that. I don't like that surface though. stone tops I want wood that doesn't even make sense why would you want to put a bar stool against a cupboard oh So that could be cute too. Oh, maybe that one. So we're trying to figure out what to use as like a an extension of the bar counter. This is this is not right. I think that might be cute. Ah, this is what I was looking for. I think that will work. Yeah. All right. Are we going to have to put some more space behind it? Also, too, we need to remember that there is not going to be any running water. No running water, like no, like no plumbing. Yeah, only beer. No plumbing, no electricity. So that means no internet which is just monstrous. Only running bear, no running bull. All right, what other fun things have we got here? Oh no, this is gonna look so fucking cute. It's making me mad how adorable this is gonna look. No. Like, what the actual. Oh, that. Why are you being like that?
so cute. Uh. Why is that one doing that? Alright, let's move this out a squidge more. Apparently it has just turned into dull building a bar. Oh, oh wait, can you filter for... Off the grid somehow? I don't, don't know if you can. I don't know, I think I'd enjoy building a bear as well. Oh, there we go, it actually says functional off the grid. Special content. Colors. It's a shame you can't search for things that are just like to see it like off the grid and be done with it. Okay. I'd say that's a pretty good little bar area. Bar is tastier. I, I think I'd much rather go to a bar than a there. All right. So, bar stools. Yeah. Then instead they'll be fighting over a I don't know. I have no idea what they'll be fighting over. The pea bush. Okay. Yeah, I really like this. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing with it, but I'm going to leave this out here. So now... We want we want a, a wall here. Is this lined up here? I think it is. Okay, there we go. The building grid does help. All right. So this wall is going to have... Whoopsie. Hey. fireplace on okay so we're gonna have to do a, an archway there what is that Ooh. 
Wait. But I like this. Why would not let me do it? Oh. My walls aren't tall enough? Oh, shit. Okay. Man, this jungle adventures pack is fucking cool. Look at that. The only thing is, then it feels like that's too tall. Feels to go. Ooh. No, this is like Hotel California. I like, I like this, I liked that archway, but such a lovely place. But I feel like the tall <laughs> mouse, I feel like the taller walls didn't really work. Oh my god. Ugh. My mouse cable's getting annoying. Oh, there we go. But I really like that archway. Ugh. No, windows is what I'm looking for here. Think? Oh no, there's really cute windows here! Oh no! That one? I think I prefer that to those. I'm sorry, Windows. It's it's not you. It's it's you. Ooh, with the blue. That's fun. Okay. Maybe? Alright, we can come back to that. Okay, good night, Ollie. Have a good sleep. Hey, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Oh, this is what I was looking for. Here, this, this. Hello. Welcome in. I hope you're having a wonderful day. There was burning. Burning burning was a thing that happened. Um Yep, yeah, it was pretty hot. And uh 
And then I uh, decided after an hour of watching the world burn that I'd had enough for now. Good night, Punky. And and now we're building a pub. Which is the, the social hub for Big Bother Twenty Four. Oh my gosh, my stomach just made the biggest rumble. Oh, that reminds me, I haven't made the rumbles yet. <sighs> uh, I think that's that one. The whole thing was, I was trying to find a doorway. That! Oh my god, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, uh, but yes, I was trying to find an archway for in here. Now I can put things where I want them. There. That'll do. Keep on deleting things. Oh, right, because I got rid of the floor. This should work now, right? We've got stairs going up to the next level. I think. Really love the reflection on that wooden floor. I don't think I've ever tried to build a bar before. Or a beer. That's actually really cute. Oh, look, there's little bunnies. But I think 
it would be better to have a couple of long tables. Forbidden footsies. I think that's the best one. Alright, I think we're actually gonna do... Um, now I feel like I'm playing Tavern Keeper. Tavern Keeper or something else? Tavern something. Stitched together from the robes of those who came from an enlightened age. Oh. We have just like a straight wooden round table. And that's kind of cute. The one other thing that I'm enjoying with this, actually, with it being like a wooden theme bar, is I'm not trying to worry about matching all the wood colours, which is something that I normally sort of obsess over. I love these. But because it's just like, I'm just letting it be all kind of whatever. We're gonna move that just over a little. Is that gonna be enough space? Thank you. Oh, does this table really only hold? That many people? That was a longer table. Oh, it does. Oh, wait, I've got move objects on. in such a weird place. I kind of love those chairs. Maybe we could do better. We don't want people to be uncomfy. That's heavy. It's kind of pretty, maybe? Wait, did... 
Oh. Is that not snapping because of its location? I think that's what it is. Here we go. I do quite like that. Okay, so that's eight to a table. I think that's pretty good. It's pretty tightly packed in here. <laughs> I'm really intrigued by this blue. I feel like that might be a fun color to sort of add in there as a, a highlight. you well that's not being nice so nice I forgot that you would do that. Oh, I forgot you'd do that too. <gasps> what? Shut up. That's... <sighs> yes? It's so cute! <gasps> ah! Why? Okay. No, I'm yelling because it's too cute and it's making me mad. Like, how dare? How heckin' dare. My, my, the way I get cute aggression for 
dumb shit. I forgot how much fun I have building in this. I turned off all the lights and now it's dark and I can't see because there we go. There. Um I wonder Daisy's doing my head in. So what if I do this up here? I don't know, maybe. Hmm. No. Hey, Mort. Yeah, I don't... I've never seen that ability, look, to actually paint the ceiling. I remember that being a thing in Sims 3, I wonder if that's new. Platform trim, okay, well it's not a platform trim. It's exterior trim. Oh, there we go. Oof, that's chunky though. That's a bit much. So we can have some trim inside, but it can't be... I can't 
put it on there, but there. Wait, hang on. Maybe I can. No, I can't. Wait, wait, can I? Ah! Interesting. Why? Okay. Yeah, the way this game does... Um... Does shit is, is weird. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna finish this room. And remove the floor. Then add the trim. Actually, I think it's the stairs interfering. I'm pretty sure it's the stairs. Oh. Sure. Okay. I mean, that's that's fine. If if that's what you want to do, game, then we can do that. I'm not going to argue. Sure. So, uh, it's better. Yeah, because then you can look down on the pub from upstairs. I mean that the rooms I put in here are going to be really small though. But, 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 but. Overhang is fine, right? Like that was a thing. I make use of space up top. See if we can find one that kind of matches. That Lou. 
That will do, pig. some bedrooms. Because it's an inn. So we need windows. Are you serious right now? Aim, please. <gasps> Look how cute. I can't. I just can't. Even with this right now. My heart! So now we've got doing windows or bedrooms. Um, why? I don't know why you're being so problematic. How long have I got till an ad break? Oh, just a couple of minutes. All right, the next ad break. They work. Um, I'm gonna go get some rice on for dinner. Oh, it's the frickin' auto cabinets. Isn't it? why it's been so weird. Okay, that's fine. That'll do. I'm trying to decide if I want to do cooking in here. I know! I was like, oh, it's so good. And it says, um... Ba -ba -ba -ba. Like it's... I've got to make sure I look for functionality off the grid. <gasps> but also, is this one. Well, I'm not going to introduce The Sims to it until January, but yeah. We've got a little while yet. Oh, okay. You've got like two weeks. Okay, so that one works in this mode. Is that it? Oh no, that one works off the grid. All right, uh, you just have to be a sub, that's all. And we'll do the same deal as last time. Um, yeah, yeah. So any sub can be in and then um, it'll be uh, the same as last couple of times where it's hands off. So you create your sim um, 
and the only time I will intervene is if things look like it's going to cause a problem, like it's bugging out, or if there's an uncomfortable interaction between sims. Um, so you can set your um, romantic and attraction issue uh, preferences when you create your sim. But if for some reason, like if your sim starts cracking onto someone that you're not comfortable with, I will 100% intervene with there. Um, but other than that, it's pretty much hands off. Yeah, those are the only options for toilets. So... Hey Bush it is! Okay. Ads are gonna drop in 30 seconds. What have we got here? Oh no, that's really cute. Stop it. I would- oh god. That's not gonna be a problem at all. Oh god, excuse me. Okay, I'm gonna take a break. Uh, I need to go put rice on for dinner. You guys should go take a break too. Uh, go clean your pee bush. And I'll be back in a couple of minutes. Thank you. 
All right, I have I have returned. Hey, Kazer, how you doing? Yes, yes, yes. Uh, um, thank you. So yeah, we're building for uh, Big Brother Twenty Four. Uh, we're we basically threw a bunch of sims representing subscribers to the channel in a lot and then we just watch what happens and it's kind of like a combination train wreck slash fish bowl you're tired oh it is late for you um so we've we've just beginning of the stream we moved all the sims out we demolished the lot and now we're rebuilding this time in a medieval village <sighs> What are you being up to to make you tired? So put the rice on for dinner and have to wee and I'm feeling much refreshed. So we need, I don't know uh, which oven we want. Yeah, I was like, it's, I know it's late there. None of these fireplaces really fit. What were you up to today? More Dyson's... Was it Dyson's Sphere Project that you were playing last time I popped in? They're all too... They're all too modern. Have we got a fire pit? <laughs> Ooh, Anna was on my list of the things to build. Oh yeah, maybe we just have everything cooked in a giant cauldron. Oh, I kind of like that actually. I kind of dig that. The cauldron of excellency. Oh, that's a lot. That is that is too much. It's a small punch bowl. It's like half the size of a sim. <laughs> so initially. I've I've done it a few different times. Um and it's it's usually hands off. So you just throw the sims in and everyone designs their own sims. So there's usually someone who run, runs around naked all the time. Um and a couple of people who are just like really grumpy and it it just there's just even without intervening there's usually some bullshit going on um but originally last year i had a plan of doing a voting a voting mechanic um where everyone could like <coughs> vote to vote for two sims and then i'd put them through a challenge but we ended up with enough uh stuff happening that I, I didn't feel like we needed to add it um so that the counter up on the top left is from the the one that we just finished so we had a couple of ghosts haunting the place and we had some house fires and I felt like that kind of kept it interesting enough that I didn't need to add in um a voting thing but there is um crowd control does work for sims 4 so i think we might kick it in or when we're playing this um and that will make sims like 
you know, pee themselves or get extra hungry or start a fight or fall in love. So I, th I think that might be a, an extra level of, of fuckery that'll make it a bit more entertaining. Um, and we've also set this so that there's no electricity or plumbing. And I, I don't know how this is going to play out because I've never played in that mode before. Um, so the, the round that we've just finished had 30 something sims in there. Stinky and cold. Yeah, especially once winter comes along. Um, yeah, that's going to be interesting. Easy ish. I just realized I need this to be a door. Oh, no, we don't have an outhouse. We've got a pea bush. This is the pea bush. These are the only two viable options for toilets without plumbing that are functional off the grid. And the pea bush does get stanky. After it's been used, it gets like a green cloud and flies buzz above it. Um, that reminds me, I need to make toilets in this. It's, oh, it's so much fun. Who doesn't love a good pea bush? No, I feel like I need. No, I don't. I don't really know what I'm doing. But I love this window so much. But it's looking pretty cute to start off with. I think we're doing a good job here. Get rid of that. Maybe. Oh, maybe we can use these little. Here we go. Now we've got a privacy screen for the toilet. Perfect. No one will ever know. And the best thing is your sims like walk into the bush and then they walk out going like this. It's amazing. I really like this archway, but I don't know if it's going to count as... Um, like a doorway for an enclosed space. A barbecue drum. Yes, an authentic barbecue drum. There's no traditional ovens that work off the grid. So we have those. living I think that's where they come in but these are the options I think off the grid nope that one's not yeah there's no agar stove which honestly surprises me off the grid yeah those are the only options there I do like that this has logs under it which is pretty cute this the the cauldron can actually be used like sims will make like giant vats of like mac and cheese which is hilarious like super big portions 
We've got grills. Ah, uh, yeah, it's a good old medieval fire starting things. I feel like this one might be the most appropriate, maybe. Like, those are cute, but... I feel like my playlist is taking the piss out of me. I don't think... <clears throat> it's actually a really nice fireplace. Oh, it's got a chimney. What? Maybe. Maybe. So yeah, really that's our options here. I think we're gonna do the the oven outside. We definitely need um wait, is that a tape? What is that? Oh, is that a coffee table or something? It's really cute. Well, I've got one there. supposed to be the bar not the kitchen I'm gonna do the kitchen as a separate space out here I think we're gonna do decided on but I think we want stone there um, and then I'm gonna do there but I'm going to do there do there maybe What did you do that for? Yeah, outdoor seating. Oh, I was hoping it would just like copy the whole group. Like, 
obsessively no lifing it. I have like 500 and something hours. I so maybe not putting the pea bush there. Maybe we'll put the pea bush around here. Oh, is that what happened? Oh, what? I was like, what's going on there? Oh, okay, good spotting. I was like, what? What's happening? Right. Oh, is that the roof being janky weird there? Okay, that's fine. Ooh. Okay. I was like, why is the pea? That's not where the pea bush is supposed to go. I might, I might have got there eventually, but I'm glad you pointed it out. do like dirt like that Like, why is this? Why is the game gonna be like that? I could do dirt or flagstone or. That's adorable. It's not. Or... <gasps> Ooh. 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 Mm. Like that. So the all the other option is to use terrain. I think a lot of the time with that sort of thing, Kaja, it's just a matter of like finding a project which really gets your attention. I think this one. Um, like something that you're really interested in and then all of a sudden, before you know it, uh, a whole evening has passed. Do 
Yeah. Hey, Karen. Yeah, we're we're doing the build for Big Bother Twenty Four. I think the paint, uh, the paint might be better. Cause then I can mess around with. Hey, there. With textures a bit. So I've saved everyone's sim from. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I've saved everyone's sim from Big Bother 23. So. <laughs> if people want to add their sim in when we do when we kick it off properly next year they can um and if you would like to have your sim in here can uh, and the same to anyone else who is a, a sub you can make your own sim and upload it to the gallery um and i can import it or um use a previous one yeah. All right, we got. I'm I'm really enjoying. I've never tried to do a build like this before. So last year, or sorry, this year, I'm already in next year. Um. So this year we had like one big massive house and it was like a big bo the big brother house everything was all interconnected and there was like a central there was a pool and lots of buildings um and then the time before that which we did it a couple of years before um i made like a bunch of tiny houses so it was like a an apartment complex this time we're aiming for a village like a medieval type village um so things are going to be a bit scuffed and janky. Um, and so I started off with a, the inn. Um, so we've got a pub. And then we're going to have like some rooms above it. And then we've got like kitchen and dining. And then we'll do like a couple of houses. Um, but we're doing off the grid, so no electricity, no running water. And I think it'll make it interesting. And I'm going to try and do it so we at least visit it once a month. Um, so Prickly suggested like if I'm not sure what I want to do, we can do it as like a... Actually, I think this year we had a point redemption, so it was like maybe we can do a community goal. Um, for like an extra extra sim stream each month yeah well it's a nice thing it's it's a fun thing to do as well like if you if you're wanting to stream but you don't really know what you feel like doing um or if just feeling a little bit out of sorts you can just fire it up and it's really fun because the the content generates itself all you have to do is narrate a bunch of sims pissing themselves and arguing Very easy. I almost feel like this should also be painted. Here. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I'm I'm having an absolute blast building already. Uh, 
and I've already just embraced the fact that all the wood colors are going to be completely wrong. So I don't want these chairs out here. I want that's outside. I think we need these chairs. Oh, what? I'd never noticed that before. Oh, the destruction, the just the tatty look is just whoopsie. Now I'm curious about other ones. I've never seen one change form with the eyedropper before. That's better. Oh. I really love these chairs, these stumps, but they just don't fit with the the other I guess it's okay oh hey bales perfect god I'm having too much fun what <laughs> why am I so entertained Ooh. Oh. Mountain. That's a comfort item? Oh, it's a seat. The Sims can sit on it. Okay, that's cute as fuck. I was like, why is this in the comfort? So for anyone who has the Sims, right now there's uh, a romantic stuff pack that's free. Um, so worth worth grabbing I'm, I'm assuming this is going to be animated are those coins on there they are that's really cute This classic fountain beckons your buttocks with its comfortable rim. I don't think they thought about the description of that. All right, let's get the kitchen done. Oh, they did. That's a good point. So we've got some little bedrooms we want to make in here. One, two, three. Oh, one, two, three. So we're going to make two small rooms and one larger one. I kind of love these. What's the difference between that? Oh, it's the actual door color. Because half the, t like, very rarely are all the Sims asleep at the same time. So, and there's no point, um, no need really to allocate sims beds to sims they just kind of go to sleep when they want why 
why is this in the bed section? That's a choice to make. Princess beds. I'm pretty excited to find out about the, um, the ceiling paint. Really? And so we're gonna flip this around. And then, um, unmagical mirror. Some of these are so huge. I think that'll do. And then we'll put some mirrors in here. Oh, I didn't think about it. Oh, shit. It's really cute. <gasps> All the bookshelves. No, look. I'm not getting... I'm just doing basic stuff right now. Basic, basic, basic. Turn the lights off and figure out lighting. The grid. Wait, that's off the grid? Oh, that's really cute. as well no it's so cute okay and then there's like little bug lamp it is gnomes arms menu Traditional medieval marker. Oh, there's different pictures. That one. Okay. What else have we got?
trying to find light sources that will work without power. Jeez, there's not a lot, is there? Oh, wait, no, I'm in... Uh... I realized I was on the wrong thing. I'm s Do these? I don't think those work. Oh, those are pretty. Alright. Feast of Candles. Can't do it. But at least get one of everything put down, then I'll be able to see what I can use. thrilled about that one. Wait, what? Oh, it works with a, a lantern? Oh. And being able to filter by that function would be amazing. Oh, interesting. Oh my gosh, there's actually some really cute ones that will work. Wow, that's really cool. fan of that. I don't really like that. There's some solid options for lighting though. So I'm not fussed with this one. I have no idea what the fuck this is supposed to be. It should have been something little that I can...
Two objects. It's like a little lantern thing. That sort of stuck itself to the fence post, but I guess not here. Oh, that's this one. But I don't think it'll do anything because we don't have power here. I don't know what they connected to. Yep, got none power. chandelier there's re some really beautiful light fittings that I hadn't even looked at really oh you know what I should say all right, I need to go check on the rice. I will be right back. Ready.
All right, let's see if I can get his attention. Heavy nose food. I've got too many bee emotes. He does this on my channel, he'll just like spam emotes. <laughs> Alright, he knows now. Okay, so... Yeah, I really like this. That's good. Um, and that means... Oh, it's so cute! And surprisingly well lit. I think these are probably my favorite. I think these are super cute. Right, I think we're gonna make it so that through this door leads to the loose. Or oh, Alu. This one there as well. Hey goose! Alright, when Ed start I'm gonna go grab a bite to eat, but we've still got a couple of minutes, so. I 
I think you can adjust how much light these things put off as well. If it'll work. Yeah, I was kind of vaguely hopeful that I could set up the um the cauldron. Where they could just like come and get it. We're gonna get rid of the end ones there. I could do it like that or just with Kind of like the idea of like people just coming along and like scooping a bowl of food out of the cauldron but i, I don't think that's how it's gonna work <laughs> and that that's okay i think i prefer it with the archway or not actually let's see yeah i think it's fine. There's plenty of walking space. Sure. All right, let's. Throw that. I can see. I'm very happy with how this is coming together. All right, so toilets. Okay, it's popping in 30 seconds. Okay, now the ads are on. I'm gonna go grab a bite to eat. I will be right back. Again, sorry. Won't be long. Whoop.
Right. Food has been obtained. I'm not excited about it, but it's something that Flint and his mum like, so it'll do. And apparently I'm very hungry, so... Is there no door with like a little moon on it? And we're back from ads. Hello. Hi. Welcome back. I have food and we're making a toilet. Not a single outhouse door. That looks a little bit full on for bathroom door, actually. Especially the sliding bolt that closes from the outside. I am so hungry. Oh, and there's that one too. I prefer that one. All right, that is the smallest. Room I can make for a toilet.
really wish they had a stone texture that matched the bottom of that wall. That's kind of close. a way to have buildings of different heights. I'm drooling. It's fine. Totally lit. Bug. Not gonna give them a sink to wash their hands in, because none of them bloody do anyway. Sims. I mean, I suppose well, what I could do. there was another off the grid thing. It was such a gnarly toilet.
probably don't need to put a mirror in there. I'm really surprised to let me do that. Okay, well that's... A little too toilet block. was some way of getting different wall heights. Without using foundations. I did just realize it'd be kind of interesting to have I don't think that did anything did it oh no it did No, that's fine. I'm not going to mess around with it. About doing the sunken ceiling. That's really cute.
Um. Oh no, that's really cute. A rabbit for the toilet, cause you and you gotta go, you gotta go. Can I use the little Andy cap bit? Yes. I don't know. If that really works. That was kind of cute. Peter. All right, so we now have got two loose. So that's so stark. I don't think I can put anything in here actually. 
the door. Oh, that's fine. I was hoping it would do both. Okay, so now it should be the entire thing, right? I'll let you get away with a Christmas song this time. Okay, so we have... We have toilets for... For sitting and for fa going fast. Like you gotta poop, you gotta pee. Sitting and moving quickly. All right, so we've got toilets, we've got three bedrooms. I'm gonna get some more rooms upstairs, but I need to do the kitchen. Save. I should have got some more coffee while I was up. That's okay. Ooh, I have ginger beer. Ginger beer better than 
coffee. Oh, that smells so good. Mmm. Love me some ginger beer. Thanks. I was if I wanted to use it for anything. I think I do. Thanks, how you doing? We're not digging that. Definitely working that. Good. Do I have chickens and no, I well I do have access to them, but I don't use them in the Sims games because you have to care for them. <laughs> and that's a lot. When I'm playing when I'm doing the the uh playthrough like this where I'm just watching the Sims don't autonomously care for critters, and it breaks my heart. Little jerks. Oh, what if? That is a cauldron. It comes with the um, witchcraft thing, and you can use it to make giant vats of mac and cheese. play this as well more we not have any I don't want it to be four wide yeah that's that's what I prefer. But, um, I'm working on our big bother for build for this year, which is a, a sim event. So, uh, I can word. All right. I may switch that out for columns and spandrels, actually.
Why are you being like that? Oh, but what if? Oh, but what if I do? Do this. Oh, this is what I'm looking for. Yes! So I think we need to do that and then like that. But what if I do that? I'm not sure quite what effect I'm trying to go for here.
I don't know what I was trying to do, but I I did it. Yeah, I really wasn't sure what I was trying to get at there, but I think we nailed it. some white think I'm gonna add an external bit there and turn that into a chimney. Thank. Flip that. Flip out. I'm starting to feel a bit more human now. The food sort of settling in to meet them. worried about not having enough space in here but I feel like having it um now having everything kind of cramped should force the sims to interact a bit more oh fuck this is really good it's making my nose fizz Okay, so... <sighs> this is still actually quite a large kitchen.
maybe. Not sure. We had to drink this with the lid on. Saving. So, we want to make, I think I had too many ovens before. Like having um, game, please. What are you doing? Oh, oh, all right. Except, I think I want it to be oriented this way. That's really cute. Well, now I don't know.
It's Peter. All right, uh, kitchen. I don't know why I'm looking at these. None of these are going to work off the grid. Here goes my dream of having a whipped dream cupcake factory. Oh, oh lord, that's something off the grid. Oh, I like that one. That's super cute. It's the ice box. I don't know why you're being so difficult there.
Unless... Uh... uh... Okay. I think I picked the ones with the blue accent. I really like that wooden floor. I really love that there's options for, you know, like a little bit of a little bit of molding. Okay, so the middle stripe is the wood, no, the bottom stripe is the wood color. And then it's with or without mold. Probably that one. sniping <laughs> oh no is a little willow sad no then why is it weeping what did you do something. Is 
that's what I wanted. not ready to start messing with plants. So I, oh, I've got this space here, I'm not sure what to do with it. I guess I could just put a table in here too. space for decorations and stuff. an interesting one. Uh, whoop, I got absorbed and missed the air break there. Alright, I think that's probably good. Like, we could do with adding some more details, but...
All right, can I? Yes. I would say being able to paint the ceiling makes such a difference, especially if you're are you zooming around in first person? Not very easy to get to it. So we're going to do Here's the door by the way Room there Oh, I'm going to have a little corridor here.
I wonder... Eh, it was worth it. Oh, you know what? Save. Now, somewhere in here... Yeah, chimney pots, I think? I'm using the search thing for all. How do I want to deal with this? I'm okay with it being wonky.
All right, so we've got two for wait, two for six. I'm gonna switch some of these for singles. Bug legs. Bug legs. I don't think there's any way for me to get even more. The way freezers work is frustrating. Technically, this isn't outside, this is inside. That's fine, there's still some consistency there.
my god, this is just looking too fucking cute. Alright. I'm having fun! Alright, I think... I don't want to add too much more here. <laughs> Why does that look so awful all of a sudden? I feel like thatch isn't really a very good roof for this, but that's what I'm going with. Ooh, Aww, Mom, thank you. Oh, I will. I have many to pick from. Many, many AC trees. Tams and all sorts of yummy things. Yeah, I was just like, I needed that. Thank you, Flower. Yes. Yeah, right, that one clearly doesn't work. All right. Good night, lovely. Thanks for keeping me company. I have a good sleep. I didn't even realize it was ten thirty already. I had no idea it was ten thirty already.
Do we want a little, a little door coming out into a little, little balcony? I don't know if any of them will use it. Oh, I forgot about this. Ugh. Hey, why aren't you? I really don't know if anyone will use those. Alright, so we need to break up this front wall. Wait, wait, oh, uh, thank you. Hey, let me have that. Hey, why did that? Uh, must have overlapped it somewhere. Alright, that'll do. Oop. Um, if you would like, you don't have to, but if you would like, you can- Oh, I see what it is. Um. Here we go. Uh, you can pick a color from that chart, or just kind of give me an idea of what you want to add to the blanket. Which, oh, I will be giving away on um, the 14th. Actually, we'll be giving away two crochet blankets on the 14th. Um, and also, since you enjoy The Sims, if you would like, you are welcome to create a sim you to be thrown into 
the uh, the big bother event when I start it next month. Can we move that out of the way? Be there. Move you back. You can. Whew. And I am really enjoying building those. It's nice to have windows. Alright, well, clearly not that. I'm not sure what the point of this spandrel is, 
but it adds interest, so... All right, so we've got the uh, the the inn tavern done. Though it needs decoration. I love how warm the lighting is in here. It's very cozy. texture is just perfect. Um, do I want? Yeah. That's larger than I was anticipating. So that sleeps two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. Thank you. I think if we get some benches down. might actually work. Maybe. One 
works better. That's the tricky bit. Like, none of these really... work as a... Uh... Painters really kind of fit. I am so happy with that. I feel like we could have maybe messed with the shape a bit more, but pretty happy with that. Nope. Ooh. Make a pretty building and then obscure it entirely with a tree. I really love that tree.
Because now I feel like these trees are obscuring it. Mighty Hawthorn, that's what I planted already. Oh, but that's really pretty too. The salience. No, you could do that. Whoa. just a couple of little accents and then I'm gonna have to take a break because my hands are getting sore I love these. Hair yeah, stylist. <gasps> Ooh. Yes. Probably don't need a, sta a sandy stone snow. I can't talk. Snow man.
This is maybe one of my favorite parts. I don't I don't know why, but I just really like Ooh, oh my lordy, those are big. Alright, plants. Oh, I haven't even done anything in the space out here either. Uh, beep, 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 move up here. I kind of love the little barrels with the flowers in. for Big Bother 24. Yeah. If, th if that's what you mean. Yeah. Oh, oh, it's so pretty. And this time, this time, uh, I don't, I don't know if you're lucky. How are you going to be like that? Um, this time, instead of having one big house, uh, I'm doing a medieval village type thing. Medieval inspired village. So today we built a tavern um which so we've got pub and and kitchen so far and then some bedrooms and toilets and uh the bathrooms are defined as uh for, for sitting down and for on on the run Number two, number ones, and number twos. Are we in Tuscany? I like that you think that. Um, but yeah, so we've got that, and then we'll add like 
uh, a tower with like a library and science stuff and it's off the grid so there's no electricity or running water so it should make it interesting so uh you can either recycle your sim um or you can make another one and import it and then i can import it i'm gonna start bringing them in um on the week that you celebrate my birthday by starting to stream again It is, it's very economical. Okay. Well, you've got, um, you've got plenty of time. As I said, so the, the 10th, I'm going to start importing them. So that's on my birthday. And then on that Sunday, so the 14th, I'm going to do the giveaways for the blankets. But I'll have give the option ability to buy tickets all week. But it doesn't really matter. Like just whenever you make a sim, I can just add it into the yeah. Add it into the household. Um and I think I don't know if I have uh I don't know if my mod list is update. Yeah. So if you use a base game or those things, then whatever you make will show. And almost also the romance pack is free at the moment. Um, and we have ads starting in 30 seconds. But no, you can't. T Sims only have one, one body. Um, but yeah, if you if you do upload, I mean, I'll know the difference anyway. I have a feeling I'll know the difference. Um, but if you want, you can put like a hashtag and then like Big Bother Twenty Four, or put Deliria in there, and that way I'll find it a bit easier. Oh yeah, it was getting pretty long the last photo I saw. It's been a while since I saw your beautiful face. figure out what other buildings to add. We have a privacy screen for a pea bush too. a goof. 
And that's going to be on the 8th, right? Oh no! <laughs> ah, power you weirdo. That's a Monday, right? I appreciate that you do those sort of things. Okay, there we go. Oh, that's pretty. I totally read that as like SWF, not M. Never mind. Maybe? No. <gasps> oh, I can use those. Tiny globe. Oh. Oh. I don't know you'd let me put that there. Ooh, box! Oh, Jesus. Fuck, those are big boxes. That's just ridiculous. That's exciting. It's a scale. Why won't you go? Sure, that'll do. Whatever. Oh, we can have a Christmas tree. Christmas lights underneath, traditional uh, yeah. Tr traditional medieval Christmas lights. Welcome back. That's okay. Kiddos do that. We've got some traditional medieval Christmas trees. Ooh. Perfect. traditional mm. 
Nothing seems medieval like a gay bright Christmas tree. Oh, oh these are so pretty. That's true. Hmm. Oh no, look at these ivies. Ah, shit, there's too much. Now we've got all the like the wisteria and bougainvillea. <laughs> Kiwi. Yeah, it's uh it's a banger for sure. Hey, darling. It's very traditional. <gasps> Yay! I love these ruin pieces here. Good, thank you. I am like completely fucking obsessed with this again. Like, but come on, like wool brambles? What girl can resist some good wool brambles? And a giant black widow spider. What? Yes? No, to be fair, I did spend the first half an hour talking bullshit. But yeah, pretty much. I know, I am gonna have to end soon though because my hands are getting sore and I don't want to. I'm just finding some little like little little knickknacks and stuff that I can pop down. Not that I can't do it some other time. Fertilizer. Trying to resist. If it if it's any help at all. Oh Pyro, I don't know if you're interested. Um in Project Zomboys. It's too fucking cute. That's the problem. But I've just done a reset. Yeah, Kiwi, you need to to make a Kiwi sim to add to the household. Yeah, yeah. So starting in January, uh, we're kicking off Big Bother 24. Uh, so you can make a sim and then upload it to the gallery um, and I will uh, any any sub can do it and I will import them into the game um, and as usual it's hands off unless there's something like really iffy happening and then we just watch the chaos unfold and this time is medieval-ish theme ish Kind of um 
Nope, whatever you want. Um, I have some DLC. Um, but if if you pick something that I don't have in terms of clothing, it'll just, you know, it'll just fill in anyway. Um, but no, whatever, whatever you want, however you want your sim to be. However at all. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, if I don't know if you're interested in Project Zomboid Pyro, but I've just reset the server for Project Zomboid. Um, I know you have like a million different directions that you are always running in, but if you decide that you'd like to take a nosy Project Zomboid, let me know. That's probably until the next update drops for, um... That looks fucking gnarly. Until the next update drops for Vintage Story, I think I'm gonna fire up Project Zomboid again. That looks so fucking disgusting. Like, normally the food in The Sims looks great. That's like someone took a bite and just went, Heh. Ah, I'm good. Okay. Hi, Katrina. I'm fashionable all branches. Um, but yeah, also, if anyone has the Sims. Uh, already base game is free to play um, but there is a free the romantic garden pack I think is free right now um, so free shit's good right there I'm pretty happy with how this looks. Throughout our big bother. Oh, is that what it's this is? This was listed as a the fountain of gluteus maximus. <laughs> I just saw the name. It's a sitting well. Water features. Well, now I'm intrigued. Oh, some of them are hilarious. Wake up and... <laughs> That's so cute. I love this thing. Some of those are super naughty. Oh, is this it? Whispering. Oh, there it is. Oh, <gasps> Kiwi, it's so cute. Step closer, won't you? What's the harm in simply tossing in a coin? You can spare a single coin, can't you? You don't believe in magic after all. It's just an old well. Did that face just move? Did it twitch? No, it must be the shadows playing tricks on you. Bear no mind to its appearance. Make a wish. It's all in good fun, right? You've already brushed aside the warnings of locals in your hubris. They know better than to cast that lot with the wishing well. Oh, hey. Yes. 
thank you for telling me about that one, Kiwi. I don't know, see if any of them. There we go. We'll do that. It's got these, the uh, the ruins pack. Has these like tumble down walls, and I fucking love them. I, like I haven't actually played any of the content, but yeah. yeah, yeah. Though I do wonder if maybe. I think I want to put the wishing well over here actually. But yeah, I love these. Uh, Ruined walls. Kiwi's like, God damn it, Dell. Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> yes. Also, I'd like to point out that we have uh, we have four toilets uh, for uh, closed toilets but we also have some open air options for the braver souls in the term in, in the form of pea bushes <sighs> yeah There's definitely some people who are like all in on the peepers. Uh... Oh, I was wondering about that because I noticed that the option was there as a comfort item. I was like, oh, okay. What about ye oldie medieval pirate ship? Um, but yes, so this will this will kick off. There's no rush. There's absolutely no rush, but I am gonna kick this off uh, on my birthday. Uh, so that's in just under two weeks. But it's any sub is welcome to to make a sim and add it in. Um, as long as everyone understands that I will not intervene unless something really fucking weird happens. Like, I let, like, remind everyone to set the, your preferences for, like, sex and attraction and stuff. And I'm always worried that someone's gonna, like, start to, like, crack onto a sim that is, like, a row. And I'm like, please don't. Please don't. So I'd probably like intercede there, but other than that. Probably not. Oh nice, I can change the colour of the rocks. Perfect. Oh, take a load off. I guess the pub's gonna be called the wishing well then, isn't it? Hey, I can see cows on the hills behind. <laughs> Uh, 
perfect. I didn't even know about the wishing well, so I really appreciate you telling me about it, Kiwi. Missing, I could have missed out on a chance for some good shenanigans. Fireworks! Yeah, I'm not sure about that emote yet. Wait, why is it doing that? Like displaying the wrong emote that on uh, stream elements. Um. So we found. I found a mod called More Intense Fire or something like that, and that's what we used to do some damage to the first lot. And it was very... a lot of fire. We... I watched it... I watched it burn for like an hour. Genuinely watched. Uh, watch the game burn. Watch the Sims burn. Not the Sims. That would have been weird. Um, I watched the house, but I moved all the sims out and, and then set everything on fire. Don't need to do something in this space here. It was pretty good. Um, the mod was... Where was it? It's literally just called More Deadly Intense Fire. And it changes the behavior of fire in the game. Um, so you basically, it starts a fire and then you're fucked. It's awesome. Well, I thought it was awesome. Probably not so hot for... You know, other people, but... Hmm, maybe, maybe not. No, I don't... <gasps> what if I put this... Oh. No, I hate it. Never mind. <clears throat> You had no idea what existed. Mods for... Oh, right. Oh, no, that's awful. Um, yeah. I mean, you just gotta lock things up when you've got questions, you know? I know I am asking for it by putting rugs so close to the fire. But I'm choosing violence.
I really wish I could remember what I was going to say. I can't remember what I was going to say at all. Yes, I use that. So anyway, if you want to see me looking uh, like a fucking maniac, pyromaniac, uh, the first hour of stream is basically me just burning everything down. Thanks, Goose. Thank you. Um, I feel like I don't need to add anything more outside. Just need some stuff on the walls, I reckon. Oh, <gasps> what? Oh my god, that is so cool. Oh my god, that's amazing. Are they dynamic? No, they're not dynamic. I'm pretty weirdly excited about that. Okay, I don't really want spiderweb. Like none of these really work. A height chart, definitely a thing. Movie posters. Very traditional, very, yeah, yeah. Here we go. I, I wasn't sure if I would like what was coming out of this. But I really do. And the like the wall textures, the stone and stucco wall textures from the jungle pack. It's so pretty. Like the textures have got, you know, like lighting on them. Hey, well, I am. Oh, look, a lump of coal. I'll put that in Pyro's room. I haven't sent off your, your little thingy yet either, by the way. Gathering of garden stones. Okay. Well, good. I'm glad you do. Uh, bucket. Ooh, bucket. I'm pretty excited about a bucket. Just an unassuming well.
Uh, books? Sure. These books are totally... Authentic. Like, don't add more stuff. Then I add more stuff. Oh, that is cute. Look at that. Oh, the pictures change. I love that so much. Taking that for myself. that too that totally fits I haven't quite decided what else we need You got that. Uh, mm. Oh, ceiling decorations. Oh my God, I love it. like the copper game please of course those being right above the stove and the uh the cauldron are going to be really fucking hot but that's fine I know what I want to do up here. Get. All I know is I've got this mezzanine. I've got a bunch of bedrooms that I've sort of only half ass decorated because I don't think they need more. Maybe some bookshelves. Um, ye olde traditional booking this. Yes. 
Hmm. Sure. Look, that even fits on there. Perfect. And what's going to be interesting is how they, the Sims, entertain themselves because no computers, no internet. So I don't, I don't know how Pyro Sim is going to handle it, actually. I mean, that is really hideous. I'm fully expecting someone to uh, create a Sim. I just heard of something and I, I wasn't sure. What it was. R is like, I'm in, you son of a bitch. I'm doing law shit. Good night, Goots. Thanks for popping in. Oh, I love the stall. It's kind of tricky for trying to find furniture that sort of makes sense. Especially since I'm not really going for anything specific other than just like a general sort of oldness. Oh, that's kind of cute. But everything is re very regular shapes. Oh, that's awful. Oh, I'm looking at the wrong thing. What is it? Oh, I like that. That's so... It's a coffee table, not a fucking bed. Sure. Activities and skills. Knitting, cross stitch. I'll add more in when I I do my my medieval yoga room and my medieval gym and my medieval prison. Candy ball, medieval sauna, uh, 
um, pet toys. I don't have a prison mate, so I don't know what your plans are. Do we do we need to make a prison under the pub? I wish I could have done that when I ran a pub. Hey, that could be cool. Hmm. I've never messed with the um the stalls before. Okay. I'm not sure what else get in there so I'm kind of keeping it a little bit cramped because it f I noticed in our last playthrough all of the sims pretty much sort of pulled together around the seating outside and the bar oh Just had a. I don't think any of this is going to be uh, functioning off the grid, is it? I don't think there's like oh no that's really cute <gasps> Aww, he cute there's no power source so the only music will be what the sims make which is that's gonna be something But yes, I'm pretty happy with that. Um, so we'll probably, I said, we'll add a, a tower. Um, it isn't, because I've had a sim that was pyro before. Like she would just like run up to piles of leaves and set fire to them and start laughing. Um. There's a mod that adds a pyromaniac. Huh. Pyromaniac is a hidden trait that can be found in the children of firefighters. Oh no, that's Sims 3.
Yeah, I don't know. I definitely... It should. It would be a really clever way to upsell their own game. Because especially... There is actually a big sale on uh, The Sims 4 titles right now. A bunch of stuff is like 50% off. Um, I've definitely had a Sim. I don't think it's happened intentionally. It may have just panned out that way. But I've got a bunch of clips of my Sim like setting herself on fire at a campfire putting it out laughing and doing it again over and over and over again and it's like um hello and she just got up to piles of leaves and start singeing them and i was just like i mean i get it like i totally get it but also what the fuck um I would just put like Deliria or Big Brother, oh sorry, Big Bother 24. I mean, I think I have you on gallery anyway, so it's not like. I'm not gonna be able to find you. Blackfire. Perfect. That's a lot of hair. And those are some checkered pants. Slowly adding them. I think I've got most of them added. Not even pa what? Sure. Uh, you know what? I'll I'll find out. God, it's midnight. I need to stop. My hands are getting really fucking sore, and I've been building this damn pub for eight hours. <laughs> um. So tomorrow, I have to, I hate to load back into it though, because I really like it. Um, tomorrow will be, I don't know what yet. Depends on my hands, actually. Um, possibly... I don't think I have any sponsored ones this week. Uh, possibly this. Possibly starting... No, I've got no plans for the rest of... I've got no plans for the rest of the year. Uh, possibly this, or possibly... Project Zomboid. We'll see. Um, I haven't stopped with Winter Story, but I'm just waiting for the new update. I've got like two games that I'm playing and both have sort of hit a point where I just there's no point starting you because I know the update's dropping. So ooh, Jesus Christ. Camera, please. Um I What is Taco doing? I'ma send you guys over to Mr. Taco. I know. He's, he's good though. It's gonna take a while to remember. Um, I'm gonna send you guys over to uh, Mr. Taco. Um, very lovely person, not safe for work in the slightest. Uh, new followers occasionally get asked, uh, new followers get asked questions, which uh, the appropriate response is fuck off, Taco. Fuck off, Mr. Taco. Um, but yeah. Uh, everything he earns on a stream, he donates to 
uh, extra life. He's pretty cool. And he's playing Satisfactory. Um, so... <laughs> he's nice, but he's not safe for work. But he's nice. Um, I have no idea what he's up to. But I'm gonna send you over there. I'll be back tomorrow from 4pm with... This? Or... Um... Or PZ. Also... My amazing merch is available, don't forget. It's pretty cool. You need to walk around with a t-shirt that says cockballs, poopy pants. It's amazing. Um, okay, I'm gonna bugger off now and uh, go wee. So uh, here are the raid calls. Uh, copy and paste them into chat if you want. Um, I need to try and do that myself. There. Um, and I'll see you tomorrow. I'm going to keep repeating myself and it's useless. So I'm just going to go now. Bye.